About 150 million years ago, Earth's most recent supercontinent was in the process of breaking up. Sauropods dominated the lush, slowly separating landmass that would become today's familiar continents. Meanwhile, in the asteroid belt, a breakup of a different sort was taking place. The large asteroid 163 Origini was pummeled in a collision, shedding debris to form a new family of asteroids. Fast forward to 3.2 million years ago, long after the fall of the dinosaurs, when an early hominin walked upright through an Ethiopian river valley. Now, a robotic explorer, named for our most famous human ancestor, is heading to a member of the Origini asteroid family, en route to the fossils of planetary formation. Liftoff, Atlas V takes flight. NASA's Lucy mission launched in October 2021 and flew past Earth in 2022 and 2024 for a pair of gravity assists. In early 2025, Lucy entered the main asteroid belt on course for humanity's first encounter with 52246 Donald Johansson. The asteroid was named in honor of the paleoanthropologist who discovered the Lucy fossil in 1974, rewriting the textbooks on human origins. While asteroid Donald Johansson has never been seen up close, its brightness varies greatly as it rotates, suggesting an elongated shape. It is a member of the Origini family of asteroids, made from fragments of the collision that took place about 150 million years ago. Earth-based observations suggest that Donald Johansson is carbon-rich, has an average diameter of about 4 kilometers, and spins on its axis extremely slowly, giving it a 251-hour day. On Sunday, April 20th, Lucy will approach Donald Johansson from the direction of the sun, traveling 13.4 kilometers per second relative to the asteroid. As its target grows near, the spacecraft will slowly rotate, keeping the asteroid in view. Over the course of a few hours, Donald Johansson will transform from a point of light into a detailed world. Lucy's long-range reconnaissance imager will capture high-resolution pictures throughout the flyby, providing our best look yet at the asteroid. Just before closest approach, when Lucy is about 900 kilometers from its target, it will abruptly turn its instrument pointing platform away from the sun to protect its sensitive electronics. Shortly after the flyby, Lucy will perform a pitchback maneuver, changing the direction of its rotation to turn its high gain antenna toward Earth. Two hours later, data from Lucy will deliver the first close-up views of Donald Johansson, a surviving remnant of the solar system's chaotic past. Following the flyby, Lucy will continue to pass through the main asteroid belt. In August 2027, it will reach Euripides, an asteroid more than 10 times larger than Donald Johansson and a member of the Jupiter Trojans. These primordial and primitive objects are trapped in Jupiter's orbit and are considered the fossils of planetary formation. Between 2027 and 2033, Lucy will make five separate encounters with Trojan asteroids and their moons. It will become the first spacecraft to explore this ancient population, asteroids more than 1,000 times older than our most famous human ancestor, formed at the dawn of the solar system, long before dinosaurs ruled the Earth.